Hey everyone, Mac is back. Today we're going to talk about the ever so coveted army size. So I want to talk about where you get the army size, how can you obtain it from the certain areas, what you need to do. Uh, army size is very important in this game, uh, especially if you're a solo attacker. You, you want to send as many troops as you possibly can against the enemy and you'll be able to attack larger um, or bigger players um, with the more uh, larger army size so if you have a you know for instance a 1 million troop then you'll be able to uh, you know send a million troops and be able to attack those big players who maybe have like 3 million in their castle or something like that maybe 4 million depending on you know the type of power that you have and if you want to check out where or how much your army size currently is you can go into the details tab of your uh, your lord and once you go in there you scroll almost the way down to the bottom and you can see the army size here and if you even hover over it it'll tell you where you're getting that where that number is coming from that army size is coming from so um, and it can be increased even from what you see on mine so um, I will show you where we uh, we can get all those first and foremost when you upgrade your castle to level 25 you get a army size bonus of 200,000 which is one of the biggest or if not the biggest in the game which is quite amazing along with the rest of your uh, the buffs you can see here as well with the commanders and the deployment it helps but you're um, today we're worried about the army size so you can get 200 capacity with that and then to go on top of that they added the glory level to it and with the glory level you can get another 100,000 on top of that so now you're looking at 300,000 uh, troops just from your castle uh, highly advised to do this uh, make sure you get a lot of and to do this to upgrade this you need those honor banners um, so if you click back here you can see the number of honor banners that is that are needed um, for the next one that I need to get to level 9 is going to be 630 so it takes a lot so make sure you participate in the events to get them and then if you ever have a chance um, from a, get to get rewards um, where honor banners are included, then uh, uh, they're, since they're very difficult, they're well, I'd say very difficult. They're difficult to get, but they take a lot. Um, there's a lot you, have, you need a lot of them to upgrade this uh, this castle level. The next place that you can get uh, to increase your army size is in here in the tavern uh, through your friendship. Now, as you can see here you're going to be looking at the leadership portion of it so your leadership which is increases your uh, army size and your rally size so if you are a rally leader this does both this helps increase your army size plus that rally size um, so this is very very key when it comes to fighting so if we go into the friendship here we can see that seg himself has five uh, stars so every time he gets upgraded he gets five stars toward that leadership um, which is quite amazing so uh, so look for those commanders who have a lot of stars by the leadership though the the big paid commanders um, the five big ones have uh, have those which are really really good um, but also seg being the one of the cheaper ones to get has five stars as well um, if you have them awakened as well I believe this is only four since I have them awakened it went to five um, and you also so just make sure that you check out each one of your commanders and uh, increase them as much as you possibly can and your uh, army size will as well. One of the more simpler ways to upgrade your increase your army size is just to use an army buff and they're very easy to get. They um, you can in the VIP shop you can buy the 50% ones one, uh, one a day. Uh, the warriors and actually you can spend diamonds as well and in, in the diamond shop to be able to buy them too. Um, to buy the 20 percenters as well and I, yeah, actually you can buy the 50 percents too they're just way more expensive and then you have the warrior summon 75 percent that's the one you get in the elite trials so every time you the elite trials comes around every two weeks make sure that you spend the uh the 3,000 tokens and then you get the uh you get the the buff from there as well and this is just to show you in the diamond shop where you can find them so click on your diamond shop click on battle and you can see a warrior summon for both of them the 20 percent and the 50 percent You'll pay premium price in here of 2,400 diamonds and 5,000 diamonds for each one, but they're worth it if you're going to be fighting in, uh, you know, your kingdom or uh, maybe one of your events that's where you need to increase your army size buff. The next place, which is one of the more uh, prominent places to, to get your to increase your army size, is just simply is your commanders. 
Each commander will bring a certain amount of troops to battle with you when you have them in your formation. So as you can see from here, just by these five uh, commanders together, I get to 73,000 extra troops into, uh, to take into battle with me. So you can take that 73,000 as well um, and use them, uh, use them in your formations. But the biggest thing is, is that you're, uh, you know, you're, you can awaken the commanders now. So for instance, Seg is awakened. He was 11,000 and now he's 21,000. So each commander can be increased by 10,000 army size, which is really, really good. Um, right now, Gorel I have as uh, 15,000 because I don't have him uh, his level increased um, as much as I, I could have it. So um, he's only at nine instead of uh, 10. So one, once I get him up there again, he'll be able to get go from the uh, uh, go from the the 20. Well, actually, he's at 15,000 to 21,000. So he'll, he'll increase another 6,000 on top of this. And then also Chris is the same way. He's still at nine. Needs to be upgraded as well. So this is another way, and you can scroll through your commanders and see which ones are 11,000. And then um, and even further down here, like Wint, uh, Winton, I don't. He's only at 7,000. But once you get them upgraded to to different up to level 60, they'll all be 11,000 as well. Another place to look for your army size is in your nobility. So your nobility is what in, uh, what increases increases when your power increases, and then at certain levels when your merit increases. So once you have enough of both of them and you can increase further, then you increase your nobility. For instance, you can see my nobility right now is Advisor 2, uh, Quality of Legend. And I'm sorry, it is not Advisor 2. I'm sorry, it's Advisor 1. My next one will be Advisor 2. The check mark down here just means that I have enough merit. I just don't have enough power. So once I get to 500 million power, then it will be upgraded here. So right now my army size, is, uh, army size bonus that I get from this is 50,000. And once I get to the next level, it's add another 5,000 onto that. So it's not really a massive um, increase when it comes to uh, your army size, but over time this will add up because if you're starting back, you know, further, it's like 5,000 a piece to get up to each, you know, for each level. So it's a, it's a, it's just a nice little bonus to get up there. And some of these uh, levels that you increase um, or go to, it, it the increase is, uh, takes very, very little time. So this is a way to do it very quickly to get to a certain point, especially if you go out there and do some merit hunting and then also increase your power, um, you know, after you've made some more troops or some researches or whatnot. A very small bonus that you can get in army size would when you go into your album and under the secrets tab, you have an army size of 1000 here. And that's so that's just a little bit extra that you can get. Um, I don't know if they'll be able to increase this or not. Um, as of right now, it doesn't look that way. It looks like right here is just kind of the building speed and a few other things once you increase that album. But uh, every little bit helps. And uh, when you think of it, it's just a thousand. Again, if you have a 75% bonus um, on there, then you're looking at uh, 1750 uh, instead of just that 1,000. So uh, just in just for future, when you think about that and it's only a little bit, sometimes it is worth it to uh, increase it. Another way to increase your army size is in the refinement and this is one of the better places to do it because it's really not that difficult in here um, army size you just have to re-roll and re-roll until eventually you come up with the army size and you can get a nice bonus in here um, and as you can see from uh, my re-rolling that i have over 100 hundred thousand uh, army size just from the refinement alone so that's really really nice right there yeah it's a it's a massive massive boost um, to your army in here. This is where this is where you're going to make up most of your uh, army size, um, because as we talked about before, in your uh, in the castle where you get 200 and 200 for the first one, and then another 100,000 on top of that, so that's 300,000. And in here you can get a uh, you can get almost as much as that. I mean, you can see that this is blue and it's only 13, uh, 13 five, and I think here's the gold one. And um, it's up to 30,000. So if you have 30,000 on every single one of these, um, you know, times eight, that's 240,000 that you're going to have. You can have, so you get 240,000 once these are all maxed out. Uh, obviously, that's going to take a very long time um, unless you're, you know, going for the refined rough, um, you know, you're purchasing it in, uh, in quantities, uh, high quantities. But so again, this is, this is a really, really nice one to do. So just make sure you try to get the, the army size in here. Um, if you're a fighter, it's, it's very, very good. If you're not a fighter, it's not as good. You really don't care it as much. Um, but it'll still help you even if you're not a fighter for, um, rebel leaders and, uh, to, um, 
I'm sorry, rebel groups as you're uh, trying to kill them, uh, the, the, the elite 25s, because you'll have a lot more power to do so uh, through that. And last but not least, uh, the place to, incre uh, to increase your army size is your castle exteriors. So for instance, this castle exterior has, um, I, it's only a seven day one that I had that I turned on for KVK. And you can see down here that the, once you own it, it's worth 10,000 extra army size. But once this two days and two hours and change uh, leave, then um, this army size will be gone. I won't have that anymore. However, you have other, uh, uh, I should say, other castle skins in here where they give you either a permanent bonus or maybe it's not such a permanent bonus. Um, some of these are just temporary depending if you own them or not or you have them on. So for instance, this one here, which is the, um, the Grand Keep, it's an own bonus of 10,000 army size. So once I, once I enact this, or once I, I'm sorry, have this permanently, I get that 10,000 bonus automatically, which is a really nice uh, uh, buff as well. But your, some of your other ones as well, you're going to have, um, but you, if you have them actually, uh, you know, you're using them, I should say, you can get a bonus from them as well. Um, as for animations, I don't have any animations that have the, the you know, the bonus size uh, that they give to you. Actually, I only have like three of them, so I don't really use it that much anyway. Um, in the shop here, you're looking at shelter capacity, hospital uh, training, um, you know, so some of these are, mo most of them are just rally, either rally marching or, uh, but there's an army size one. So you have Hope of Winter, that could give you a permanent 5,000. So that's actually a good one there you could get. And there's a 10,000 one there too. So when you have that one, there, um, the Song of Triumph is a nice one to have. Plus it's very good with the total attack, defense, and some speed. So, and rally size. So, I mean, there are other ones in here that, are, that can be really good. So I don't have any of these permanent. I think I just have like a seven day one or something. So, you know, like an army shelter capacity temporarily and um, a couple other things here, motivation, but there's none of them here that are, uh, there's only a couple of them that have the uh, uh, the total buffs. So, um, so that's it. Those are the, that's, this is the, I just want to talk about the army size and hopefully that uh, we all were able to uh, kind of gain something from this. Um, I did, uh, Put, break it down a little bit here in this uh, little notepad just to kind of give you an idea of where these things are so you can look at this look down through this very quickly and there's only like I said only not a not a whole lot of places you can get this uh, army size increase but if you kind of focus on it with a little bit you know with you know the the army buffs there you can get some 75 percent and in your friendship and definitely your commanders um, are some really really good ones to look forward to so all right until next time uh, Mac is out